This is true AI power. With just one tool, I was able to create this. I was created in love art. So crazy, right? This, this, and then they this. They know I'm the one, got the game on lock. Every move I make, it's a power shock. And this is a straight up powerhouse. And since discovering this tool, I simply cannot stop using it. Just recently, I hired a graphic designer to redesign a few of my logos and banners. Wait, are you for real? If I'd known about this tool, I would have saved so much money. Because not only did it give me exactly what I wanted, but it did it 10 times better than I thought it would. The tool I'm talking about today is a surefire game changer, and it's called Love Art. Love Art is your AI powered design ally and it's the world's first design agent. Just by simply having a chat, you can create tons of masterpieces from logos, banners, movie posters, full media kits, and even AI video. In a world of ice and fire, legends are forged in blood. One warrior stands against the darkness and AI images. Wait, are you for real? This is like- But now it's available for all to use. Bro, the best tool ever, OMG. So unlike traditional generators that rely on one model and fixed prompts, LoveArt can think, remember, and autonomously orchestrate multiple models and tools to complete complex design tasks. You can really do that? Okay, so here we are on LoveArt's homepage and you can see it's just loveart.ai. Now, one thing I do love about this is that this website is incredibly user-friendly. Great look, great feel, great overall aesthetic. But right off the bat, you can see everything that you can easily do, okay? Now, in order to use this, you simply just do everything through a chat. The cool thing about it is that you just use everyday language. Just talk to it like you would a friend, like a text message. Now, right here, you can see the pricing. If I select monthly and yearly, yearly right off the bat, $15 a month, amazing deal. Then it goes all the way to basic and then pro. But I think once you see the capabilities, this is gonna allow you to eliminate so many subscriptions and spend less money using outside sources to create your content. So once you're logged in like I am right here, I can scroll down and see even more examples and options of everything that you see on this page. This was all created directly right here within Love Art, and you could just tell right off the bat, look at how good that these designs actually look. So let me show you this right here. Here is a video I actually created with a just simple prompt, okay? This was amazingly done. Again, all done in love art. In addition to a huge brand kit for my new slogan called Let's AI. But as I scroll down, look at all of this amazingness. You can see up here, I even got all of these banners. Now look at this right here. This is what is so cool about this. There are multiple images right here. Now at the very top, what I basically said was make a music video for an hip hop EDM song, one minute long with fast cuts. Okay. It went ahead and gave me everything I wanted. Now on the right hand side this is the full ai generated soundtrack four minutes long it went ahead and gave me the full thing so you can see even the ai audio is amazing now over here it starts with a cling video generation that's going to be the first one pretty good watch this as i scroll down it gives me more and more more videos then for the final product now as i scroll down look at everything it's giving me right here now i can press play on each individual one but what this does is since I wanted a one minute long video, it's gonna go ahead and piece everything together for me, thus at the bottom right hand corner, giving me my full one minute video. Check this out. And remember, it also includes the AI generated audio soundtrack. Now, everything we can do is started right here in this prompt dialog box. I can also select the internet research button and give LoveArt full complete internet research capabilities to really research and find my specific needs. Okay, so let me first go ahead and show you a quick cheat code. Now watch this right here. Over here in the middle, I'm gonna go ahead and paste this in. This is gonna be a prompt to generate image. I'm gonna go ahead and say create image and we're gonna make it a portrait of a 
Viking Warrior. Anytime you start the process over on the right hand side, this is going to be where you have your chat and you're going to instruct the agent for all of your creations and needs. In the middle is going to be the canvas to where it's going to instantly provide you with the designs it created. Now, as this is thinking, let me go ahead and open up another chat. Watch this. Now I'm going to come in here, paste this same exact prompt, but this time I'm not going to say create an image. I'm going to say make this prompt 10 times better using the best prompt adherence strategies. Now let's go ahead and submit this one. Now, while that one is thinking, let's go back to the original one over here on the right hand side. Down here at the very bottom right hand corner, look at this right here. Now I have even more options. For an example, if I select this last one over here, it's called model preferences. Look at all of these options we have. We're going to have image. Now for specific images, we have everything from GPT image one, flux, context, pro and max, Gemini, I imagine three recraft ideogram then below that is where video comes in cling 2.1 and gemini vo3 and then even runway gen 4 but then what i also like are going to be these 3d specific ones now again we have another option that's called use style once i select use style more things populate right here to give me some very good visual options but now going up look at that there is my image of that viking warrior now watch this now i'm in the canvas in the middle. Go ahead and click on this image. Now we're going to have all of our other editing options right here, right at our fingertips. Up here at the very top, we have another menu. Select and hand tool, image generator, video generator, frame, insert. We can insert more items. I can upscale the image perform some outpainting tasks so I can even make it like you see in this image here. I can make my aspect ratio wider. Let's do that. Go ahead and now select outpaint. Now I'm going to go from a 1-1 to a 16-9 wider angle. Now again, it's kind of phased out right here, but we also have an instant background remover tool, an object or item remover tool, and a lot more options. Now, while we get our new aspect ratio, let's go back over here to our other chat. Remember I said, make this prompt 10 times better. Look at this right here. It even provided me with award-winning National Geographic keywords. And then it gives me the specific reasons why this prompt was enhanced. So now doing that, I'll go ahead and say down here at the bottom with the prompt you just provided, go ahead and now generate that image. But this time, let's open up a model preference and to generate our image, let's go ahead and do it using Flux Context Max. Let's come back over here and now look at our outpainting. Instantly done and I couldn't be more impressed. All right, so check this out. I'm gonna say I need a new logo, modern, innovative, and clean, okay? I'm now gonna come in here and bring and drop in my Metrics Mule logo. This is the one I'm gonna reference. Okay, and now there it is right there. Now, after we get our logo, I can even add more options. For an example, I could do the same thing with my slogan or even my mascot. I'm gonna copy what I originally said Paste that same thing in there, but this time I'm gonna add my mascot. So now we're gonna have multiple going at the same time. Okay, but now let's go back to our other Viking image. Remember I said regenerate it, but using that prompt that you gave me that's 10 times better? I have to be honest with you, it is 10 times better. Look at the difference between the two. Especially if I come in here and I outpaint this one to 16.9, then we'll really notice the difference in how much improvement this one actually is. Okay, so now let's go back to our other one about our specific specific logo for Metrics Mule. Look at this. Over here on the right hand side, it says right here, I've analyzed your logo and found some inspiration. Go ahead and select an option that you like and we'll base your new creation around that. You can simply do it by clicking any of them and as you do, it will put it down there in the chat. Now hit that enter button. Let's go back to this Viking and now with an outpaint of 16.9, Look how much better this does look. Now, watch what we're going to do next. Bottom right hand corner. Now, we're going to say this. Two things I want to show you. Let's get an amazing movie poster, but we can also generate this in an amazing cinematic trailer using AI video. While that's thinking, let's go ahead and do this one while we're at it. He swings his ax and says, I'm the Dragon King. Now, with this being said, I'm going to go ahead and select my model. For my model, I will then select 
Gemini VO3, okay? That is selected. Now, let's go ahead and create this video. Let's go back over here and we can see that we are still having our design being thought. Now, let's go back and check out our other ones very quickly for our logos and our full redesigns. This one is still thinking. However, this one over here is ready for me to make a decision. It's asking me what style I want from a pure AI monogram, minimal donkey silhouette, or a spark cluster plus a word mark interesting options but now look at this when we come back to this image for our movie poster wow look how amazing this is in fact if i look at this closer everything is spelled accurately but now look at this back over to my other one for metrics mule where i wanted a completely new look and logo look at all these amazing options let's go ahead and keep it clean and simple i'll select this middle one and now watch this i'd like to pick option two now with that selected create a full brand kit and now back over here on this one right here it did complete the video process let's go ahead make this larger and now let's go ahead and hit this play button i am the dragon king I am truly blown away by the capabilities all under one roof. Like I said, every time I use this tool, it just gets better and better. Now, check this out. This is where things really start to blow me away. Now, based on this Viking and everything I got, let's now transform this Viking into a 30-second music video, EDM hip-hop style, where the Viking's the main character, and we're gonna have some glitch transitions and cinematic effects. Now, back over here, look at this right here. Now, again, it took the initiative and it gave me these other amazing icons. I really love the way this looked. Look, look at this. Now remember, this is our 3D mascot that's called Metrics. It even spelled Metrics correct. So this is definitely downloadable right here. Now let's go on to our next chat and look at our full kit right here. Look at this. Now this is based off of our new app icon. This looks amazing with that AI. And it even gave me this innovative tech looking mock-up and a cool looking business card mock-up right here very impressive now if we come back over to this one look how amazing all of these design looks the letterhead the icon logo banners and look at this the full mock-up guideline system right here with the specific colors i should be using the whole design process okay let's go back over here and now remember i said on this one i wanted the full music video i am the warrior from the north axe in hand i come forth eyes of blue face of war hear my battle cry roar dragons fly through the sky fire and ice do or die viking legend never ends as my fury transcends So it looks like now all of our creations are done from the full music video to our mock-ups design kits everything i wanted it's all done imagine having a graphic design team able to work on this and have everything complete in under an hour and i'm talking about design heavy features i've been requesting so there you have it love art is quickly becoming one of my most favorite go-to tools for a complete design process it really is like having a professional design agent in your back pocket but let me know what you guys think in the comments below and remember check the links in the description and if you like this video please remember to hit that subscribe button until then i'll see you next time.